So from one number 10, a hexagonal pyramid of base say 30 mm and axis length 50 mm is lying on the HP on one of its triangular faces with its axis parallel to VP. We will draw the position. So we are going to place the hexagonal pyramid with one of its triangular faces on the HP. So it is better to start with the side position. Then only you will be able to get the triangular face on HP. So here is your hexagon. You have the complete hexagon. You have to join these lines uh, for pyramid. Then you can name the corresponding points here. A dash, then B dash is invisible. C dash is invisible. Then D dash is visible. E dash is visible. D dash is invisible. F dash is visible. We have O dash. Now, you have to take this line O dash, D dash, E dash place it on the ground. So therefore, we put O1 dash, D1 dash invisible, E1 dash is visible. So now one of, it, one of the triangular faces on HP, therefore the front view of that triangular face is on XY line. Take this distance, make an arc from here. Similarly, take this land gate distance. From here, we make another arc. So now that position is obtained. So here in this position, you have the hexagonal pyramid resting on the ground with one of its triangular face on HP. So name this point. This is A dash. Right? Then you have A1 dash visible, B1 dash invisible. The next point is C1 dash, C1 dash invisible, D1 dash is invisible, E1 dash is visible, F1 dash is visible. Now try to project this. Project these points. We will getting the final top view. A horizontal and A vertical gets you A1. B horizontal and B vertical is B1. C horizontal and C vertical gives you C1. Similarly, D horizontal and D vertical gives you D1. E horizontal and E vertical gives you E1, F horizontal and F vertical gives you F1, O horizontal and O vertical gives you O1. In the same way as in the previous case, draw the extreme edges first, just connect them by dark line. Then try to follow the order. The order is A to B, B to C, C to D, B to E, E to F, then A. It's a common point to go. You have to connect OA, OB, OC, OD, OE, OF, and OA. So here, uh, when we follow the rule, we identify this as extreme corner. This is another extreme corner. Everything is visible except OD and OE. So OD is dotted, and uh, OE is dotted. So OD and OD. OD is dotted. OE is dotted. Other than that, everything is visible. So ABCD is visible. Write AB, BC, CD is H, B is H, EF is H, FA. Again OA, OA is also visible. OA is visible. So make dark line. OB is visible. Make another dark line. OC, OC is H, so you can leave it. NJ is as it is visible. OD is dotted, so dotted line, OE is dotted line, OF is H, so you can leave it. So this is the final top view for the hexagonal pyramid resting on the ground with one of its triangular faces. You see the three points of the triangle, O, D, E, they are on the XY line. So one of the triangular face is on HP now.